This is Insider Medicine in 60 from Oklahoma. A more efficient method to develop monoclonal antibodies has been developed. In a study of a group of healthy volunteers who were vaccinated against the flu, researchers noted that when a specific type of white blood cell called an antibody-secreting plasma cell was cultured, monoclonal antibodies were quickly created in large amounts. The findings could be important in the development of monitoring for outbreaks for diseases like the bird flu and potential treatments and vaccines. From Washington, Aspirin may lower the risk of developing estrogen-positive breast cancer. In a study of 127,000 women who participated in a prospective study analyzing various risk factors including diet and medications on the development of various diseases, the use of aspirin lowered the risk of estrogen-positive breast cancer by 16 percent. However, when all breast cancers were taken together, aspirin no longer had a preventative effect. And finally from Ottawa, the Canadian Food Inspection Agency has issued a warning concerning cumin, a spice frequently found in chili powder. The product in question, manufactured by the Quebec company GD, is being voluntarily recalled due to fears of salmonella contamination. Salmonella can cause serious illness, especially in the young and elderly. For Insider Medicine in 60, I'm Dr. Susan Sharma.